If you're getting the issue in Windows 10 or 11 where you're having this caps lock icon pop up on your screen, like you can see on the bottom of uh, my screen here, there's a few ways you can fix it that I'll walk you through. Uh, so typically this is caused by software on your computer. In my case, it was caused by Logi Options, but there's also an HP issue with this that I'll show you in a second. So just go to your start menu and type in Logi Options to make sure you don't have that. Uh, this is just the software for Logitech. Then you click in the top right, the settings button, scroll down and uh, uncheck it. And then you should be able to press caps lock without that notification popping up. Uh, if that doesn't work for you, uh, another thing you can do is check if you have HP system event utility by typing that in your start menu tray. Um, and it'll show up here. I'm not on an HP computer, so I don't see that. But um, if you did have that, what you can do is go to add or remove programs and then just remove HP system event utility. From there, uh, you should have been able to remove the common software that causes that caps lock issue and be able to press caps lock without that pop-up pop coming up. Another thing you can check if neither of those worked for you is just by going to your tray icons in the bottom right corner of your windows and then uh, just kind of clicking, looking through these and uh, going into the settings and checking if there's any setting related to keyboard uh, notifications. There's a lot of solutions online that may work for other people that um, didn't work for me. But if you go to start and you go to control panel, uh, make sure you have large icons turned on in this top right corner. Go to East of Use Access Center, and then just look through uh, some of your settings for make the keyboard easier to use or make the computer easier to use. And then once you're in there, there's a few options. None of these worked for me, but uh, some of them are related to pressing keys. So it's possible you might have settings in there that cause that but typically this will be caused by software. I hope this solved your issue. If it did, I'll be making more tutorials in the future, so please like and subscribe.